All right, then we're just finding a good time to start actually saying welcome back. Yeah. Uh. Um. We're not. Yeah. We. We just. We. We're. We're. We're gonna be a bit more in the air of our physical attacks. I can tell you that much. Yeah. And our limits aren't gonna. Oh, cheer. Sure. And, oh, and yeah, no, jackpot, yeah. jackpot. We definitely want jackpot because he'll drop more stuff. Right. Um. Uh, tech boost. Yeah, and we don't need. Uh. Yeah, it doesn't matter <laughs> at this point. Yeah. Um. um scroll down. Uh, come on, Mister Treasure, Treasure Magnet. Uh yeah. Um. Come on, uh, Empty haste. Why are you taking up? Oh. Yeah. I, I, well, we Critical just. Plus we want. Yeah. What's I'm, the I'm, get, I'm getting rid of the other. Finishes. Okay, vortex. Uh, closer distance. See, I turned that off earlier because it's kind of a slow move compared to mm. all the others. Mm. Come on, plus. MP Rage. Here, uh, come on, plus. Come on, plus. Two MP Rages is nice. I don't think we need any more combo pluses, to be honest. Alright, well, because we're also going to really. Oh, yeah, by the way, um. What is it? Um. I think. I think hit try oh hit, um hit any ability and press X. Alright. Rearrange. Oh rearrange? Yeah. What does this do? Now they're now they're now they're oh wait, is it how do you you should re oh I probably rearrange it off of alph alphabetically by now, or is that Kingdom Hearts 2? I oh, sort. Oh go to sort. Sort by type. Hmm. Now everything's organized in a neat little list. Ah, oh, okay. Why do we have so many tech boosts? <laughs> we can take them off. We don't need them anymore. Yeah. Let's see. Let's look around. Uh, um, we can. Oh, th oh, this means we can at least use them for um, limits later. Yeah. Um. Um. R let's see, Ragnar right, yeah, right, right, right might be worth having on at least. Yeah, that's the only one I can think of that would help for this. Alright, scroll up. Uh, Berserk, just in case, I guess. Um, do you have a treasure magnet? Scan, Um, yeah. yeah let's yeah, hard game plus is fine. Um. Uh, I think we're good, actually. Do you think? Uh... No, 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 no. Put on experience zero. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, it, it means nothing. No no no, 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 just turn it back on because I, I, I don't even know if it's gonna show up in numbers. <laughs> you know? Yeah. I like Combo <laughs> Master, so. All right, then let's go. I think it, we're good. I think that should be okay. Uh, All right then. Then should be okay. All right, even <laughs> Aladdin. Oh yeah, also this. Oh yeah, we, we might need to put on uh, Alexis in first. No, let's save our elixirs for the fight next fights. Yeah, so... Um, ethers. Let me just load on on ethers. Uh, so weird. Yeah. Okay, um, and check out the summon. Make sure Tinkerbell's still on the shortcut. No, oh, it, it resets. Good thing. Good thing. Yeah. Right, uh, remember, the moment of okay, alright, I'm ready. Hold on, let's say it. And welcome back. <laughs> yep. Just stabbing Donald. And we are kind of overkill for this, but now we're gonna take on the optional bosses. Yep, we did a lot of grinding with the synthesis stuff. I did Hades Cup off screen, the uh, Sora alone time attack, and we have uh, what I assume to be Donald and Goofy's best weapons. Yeah. And here we are. Yep. Yep. But now it's time for the optional bosses, starting with this one. Well, after Ice Titan is. Yep. The Agrabah weapon, Kurt Zisa. Yep. Now go to your summons quickly. Yeah, you want to do this immediately because um, you, that thing that Kurt just tried to do is silence. It makes. Doesn't it make you say you can't use magic? Magic is completely off until it wears off. Right. And now. Which means now Don and Goofy are effectively useless. Right. To, the, to get rid of the silence, you have to throw those two orbs on his, on his uh, hands. The thing is, though, if you didn't get rid of these, out. Um. Uh, well, basically, the thing is, he's attacking you a lot, and he's really aggressive, so you really don't want to rely on item healing. Tinkerbell's your best way to go at it. Right. 
And again, she stays out until you die, so... Yeah. And now once once you break both of them, he's um, down. You just gotta keep hitting the head here. Right. Um... So, fun fact about Kurt Zisa, apparently. He's uh, named after a uh, contest winner? Yeah, apart I don't really know the specific details, but it's like some contest winner act that's actually called uh, uh, Kurt Zisa 1. And I just find that pretty fr freaking hilarious. So anyways, this is, um, I believe, I think this is Shell or Protect that he's doing right now. Mm. But, um, but whatever it is, he's um, now immune to physical attacks. Yeah. You need to use magic in order to break it, and Bundaga is probably your best bet as he does the most damage. Right. You can also try to hit with some pretty high level magic weapons, like, like these tornadoes here. 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 But, he, so. but as you hit it normally though, as Don and Goofy just demonstrated, um, actually, he'll drop MP balls. Now, and but the more you damage him, the faster he'll get back up too from this. Oh, okay. And, uh, oh, and here comes, so yeah, he's gonna do a silence one more time. He just goes on a pattern of this. Now, right. now, now, oh god, here comes. This is one of his hardest attacks. You have to jump over that and dodge roll just the right time with that. Yeah, you can't just, uh, spam dodge roll on this, because if you do, you're, you're, it's basically gonna cause more harm than good. But, 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 his approach aim for an idea, I think it's best to stay as close to Kurt as you can during, aim during the second rotation. Because otherwise he's more prompt, he's more likely to, to do those spin attacks. Right. And if you decide not to go with Donald and Goof, aim with on Tinkerbell, um, he, he, she, he, that may be a problem. Right. But, um, Harry was telling me earlier that, um, when he has the shield up, a good idea is to use Mushu. Well, it does, right. from what I've seen, it does a lot of uh, damage to the shield, but since you can't have... At the same have... time, you can just do your own magic. Yeah. It looked cool, though, but you can't have two summons at once, so that causes a huge risk. Yeah. And I mean... Well, well that's one thing I really like about uh, 1 and 2, is that there's a lot of different strategies. There's not just one way to go. What, not one way to go through things. I didn't know he dropped the Mega Potion. I didn't know that either. I didn't know bosses could. I didn't know bosses could even drop potions. Why? Well, yeah, good point. <laughs> well, no, no, no. Remember, um, Stealth Steve dropped the High Potion. Oh yeah. I guess I can. I guess that counts. I gotta say though, of the optional bosses, this is probably one of I mean, this is probably the most out of nowhere. But it's probably, it's probably one of my favorites in terms of the fight. You know? It is pretty cool. It's if you pay attention, it's probably one of the easier ones. Yeah. And and he's down. Um, That's the power of level 100 grinding with ultimate weapons. Yeah. By the way, I don't even know if you can bring a lion into this fight. <laughs> I never tried, and I don't see why you would. Yeah, especially now that Donald and Goofy have their best weapons. Mm -hmm. By the way, as a joke, we were planning on turning on a uh, Spearing Zero, but whatever. I might, I and you might, can tell from that Hardy's an artificial heartless. Yeah, I might actually uh, leave that in. <laughs> <laughs> With all that, our little bloop I take it for? Yeah, just like, pull an XP Zero. <laughs> and now Sora gets a new limit, Zonketsuken. And from what I know, uh, that's actually a good finisher for to use for uh, unknown. So, um, let's see what it says in the description. Oh yeah, oh yeah, we organized our list finally. <laughs> yep. So it's uh... uh, go to sort. I think. I think because I think it goes back into a list. Sort it again. Let's see by type. Let's see, there it is. Zonketsuken. Pr Thirty chance. A 30% chance of unleashing a finishing combo attack that can destroy a weaker enemy. And it's also really fast in this game. Like, I believe in the other games it's like a slow but powerful hit. In this game it's like almost instant, so... Like Slapshot instant? Uh, it's not that quick, but... You know how in the other games, like, the character like stops for a couple seconds and launches? Um, it, Back off! Boom! Yeah, it basically cancels that and just goes... It, it just... Like cut straight to the attack, pretty much. Isn't it like Sora just like does like a like a animation where he like has his like his hands behind him or something? Something like that, yeah. Like 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 he just slashed him in half or something. 
Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Usually when I hear Zonketsuka and I think of uh, Zero for the Mega Man X series. Yeah. I don't know if it will help in the other bosses, so uh, I think we should just leave it for now. <laughs> and that... So, all right, and that's it for Kurtzisa. Oh, by the way, in the original version of one, you, in that, it's literally just an optional fight. You don't get anything else out of it. Mm. For that matter, um, when we took on um, um, Ice Titan earlier, yep. he didn't, he, he, in the original version, he didn't drop anything. Like the the uh, the Diamond Dust Keyblade is Final Mix exclusive. Yeah, like it, it does feel nice to actually get a reward from these guys. Yeah. Next up, we're going to go to the yeah, we're going to go to the cabin, and we're going to need to prepare for a little bit, so we're going to do a quick jump. Yep, going to have to change our customization. Oh, we're going to have to change it a lot. Yeah. Because this one can be rather annoying. Okay, so. Right. What do you say? Oh, right, right, this is about the spy box, yeah. Right, I'll one. Take it, 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 But you, uh, go ahead. Uh, well, there, there's this uh, uh, trophy you said that you get uh, where you can beat the game without dying or whatever. Um, if we, <laughs> we can still technically get that because I don't think we've died yet. Have we? Mm, not count if we don't count the arena. No. Does it count that? I doubt it. It has to be a game over, I think. Mm. Now, by the way, a reason uh, you, you might notice when you come here with a clock tower won't be access accessible. Right. This is why. Yeah, if you had dinoed out, then you can't go here, I believe. No, because I can't understand what Tink's saying. Ah, oh, right, that makes sense. What's going on here? Devin Steve's wrong. Mm. Hello. Uh. I'm a ghost. <laughs> this is this is in, in the Phantom. Mm. Now the first thing you want to do is hover to the clock. The moment you see it flash, oh, go down. Yep. Now what he just did there was Doom. He put Doom on Peter on Peter Pan right now. Yep. If that counter hits zero, Peter is technically considered dead, meaning you cannot yeah. revive him. Yeah, and like the. His heart thing is like, uh, you need to do a specific uh, magic attack, or if it's white, just attack him normally. Right. When you in, you can hit him three times before it before that before it flashes white. Once it flashes white, he'll uh, do it. He'll um, do one or two attacks. He'll either do um, a revenge slash, or he'll do a, uh, or or he'll do what I just call the worm. Mm. Run to another face of the clock now, because he's about to do the worm. This is, it's homing, so, and but if you run to another face of the clock, you'll be safe. I cast stop now. Give it, give, give the clock another boot, you know? But yeah, but like, once I, what, if you, if we don't stop it, the, um, that, Fire. like I said, Peter's dead, like, you won't see his health bar Fire. anymore, even. Mm. The main thing with this guy is that he just moves a lot, so it's a lot hard to, it's very hard to get a, a consistent Fire. hit. Ow. Yeah, he, hurts, I, he hurts though. Yeah. Oh, he's doing the worm. Fire. Oh, here it comes. I think. Okay, I think you dodged it. Yeah, it's like. Thunder. Thunder. Well, yeah, when he gets the when it's uh, thunder, the, it's like basically um, a little br breath of fresh air because it's so much easier to land that. Thanks, Goofy. Ah. Um, 
otherwise he's a pretty simple fight. He just he, like we just say he just moves around a lot. Yeah, he he's uh you have to What the hell? He's what? doing the worm. Alright. Oh er, er, Aroga. I don't know, I don't know. Okay, we're good. Sorry, I thought I thought I was gonna hit you. I think you missed the clock. I think you tried to cast a stop on him, actually. <laughs> it's constantly changed. And, um, this guy can kind of drag a little bit, though. Yeah, he takes a while. It's a unique, unique concept for Busto. I think he's. I think he's actually based off something from Peter Pan, a financial book of Peter Pan. Yeah, I was uh -oh. gonna. Yeah, I was gonna ask if it was uh, from. Uh, Something from Peter Pan or Final Fantasy or whatever. Well, he he's based off he, the the he's based off something called Lord Ombra, I think it was. Hmm. I think I think Peter and Goofy just used their things on him. <laughs> but yeah, the, you don't want to you really want to keep their abilities off because otherwise Peter Pan will piss through his abilities. <laughs> is MP and then Goofy just wasted on him. Right, right. I get I get you. Because you know he can still use the abilities in the air. Yeah. Oh, come on. Yeah, eventually it just gets to the point where you just want him to stay still. Yeah. He, uh, honestly, I mean, well, he's my second least favorite of them, uh, next, to, next to Ice Titan. Mm. Yeah, because yeah, Ice, I guess so, uh, yeah. Just because Ice Titan's a pest. Yeah, Ice Titan is a pest. This guy, um, interesting concept, but drags. Yeah, he, he, he at least, he's at least a lot more of a fight, it, it, yeah. you know? Yeah, it's not... It's not a fact like Ice Time where like things just go all over the place, and you, you it, it's it's pretty much unavoidable getting hurt. Yeah. Here, if you, it, it, it's very, I don't, it's very wide open, but even though it doesn't feel like it at times. Yeah. So like Ice Time, uh, good luck doing a 100% no damage run. Yeah. I mean, if you do that in the first place, uh, what's wrong with you? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah right, but um, and a thing is though um, if once the clock take once the doom spell takes someone, he'll then after a little bit he'll cast it on on uh, Goofy in this case, and then yeah. Sora. But yeah. if it gets to Sora, but if the timer gets to Sora, you probably want to rethink your strategy. Yeah. Hopefully it doesn't come down to that. Well, we're doing really good. He, he's only, he has less health than Kurtziza does. Right. He, he's just taking longer because it's the Phantom. And you, yeah, again, you need magic, and it's air combat, so. Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm gonna run it. I'm gonna some random music. Here. I know, I know, we're not even playing on the right boss theme, but. Just imagine if this guy had like uh, as much health as uh, like some of the other guys. Yeah. But to at be least... fair to this guy, he's the e he's probably the easiest. Yeah, probably. In fact, that's pro in fact, you're probably um, you can take him on a lot earlier. Yeah. It's just that it's gonna drag. It's gonna drag even more. And it just uh, for just the uh, play for it made more sense to just wait for the optional bosses for the end. Right. But the the, the only problem is um, do after doing this, we're gonna get something a little too late. Yeah. Yeah. It's something that really would help against uh, some of the stuff we had to do. Oh, worm. Yeah, Cause especially because it would make Donald a lot more useful. Yeah, stealth soldiers and the uh, jet balloon harness or whatever are the main yeah. things I can think of. But these, but yeah. Thanks, Goofy. <laughs> yeah, thanks to Goofy, we haven't had to use an item yet. Yeah. Well, it's also because we, we give him so much MP. Yeah. And I think Peter Pan might be loading him up with Ethers. Hmm. Right. If that's the case, then thank you both of them. Yep. Um, yes. another boss. Oh, what the? Another boss in Kingdom Hearts that actually uses Doom, or at least a form of Doom, is uh, Marluxia. Oh, yeah. I think it's, um, Doom. I think that's called Doom Scythe, though. Where um, it's it's only based on if he hits you with the scythe. Right. 
Oh, you're talking about the... Kingdom Hearts 2 version. Yeah, the final mix. Right, right. I thought you were talking yeah, about Chain of Memories yeah, for a second. That is a Doom count above Sora's head. Yeah. That's also, why he, that's also why you may notice he doesn't take damage during that fight. Yeah. It's all based on just how well you can dodge him. Yeah. I thought you could still uh, take damage and die normally, can't Never. you? Worm. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna get hurt. Right. I think it was, I think it was wrong. This wasn't it. Yeah. Um. You can't. Yeah. I think. I think. Sorry. I think though, if you actually take damage at all first, it, like if there's a point you take damage, then he starts actually hurting you. Ah. Oh, right. Right. That's actually. You know, a, he's not. He's not supposed to hurt you mm, like that. That's actually uh one of my uh favorite deifies because it's very cleverly designed. Yeah. And where where you're um it's ba oh Peter's dead. Come on. Clock. The clock. The clock. It's a Peter. Please. Come on. Just die. A rogue can get rid of that, just so you know. Oh, okay. See ya. Come on. See ya. Yes. Yes. Bye. Right. <laughs> yeah, the... yeah, at least we get to show off what happens when Doom takes you. Because yeah. you may have noticed it took Peter's heart flat out. Yeah, he's. He's dead. No. He was dead. He's not gonna he be was in. Dead. Well, yeah, but I mean, that it was just that's, that's kind of scary. It would be like, uh, he's not in two, the other games because of that. <laughs> no. So like, Nomura's just like, oh, one random guy just uh, <laughs> made uh, was it Peter Pan die in this optional bus? Okay, he's not in any other the any of the other games now.